Welcome back to Cleveland Under Rocks, Elias and Bourbon Bar, and I'm Matt, and that's James, and we got a new bottle from 626 Whiskey Club. Yes, sir. Welcome back, guys. We got a bottle from 626 Whiskey Club. So this is Left Twix. It is barrel 14CB, 6B, sorry, proof 124.50, APV 22.25, still January 2016, bottled April 2023, mash bill is 75% corn, 21% rye, and 4% barley. Heck yeah. You know what I've seen from this bottle? What do you think I see from this bottle? Go ahead and show the people. What did I see here? Twix. Twix! And I was like, yo, we have to do a video on that. You know why? Because it looks super freaking cool. It is. It's so, your, your crazy cool bottle has a twist top. I need to know about this. So, this is from, this is from where? What, what? So, 626 six Picks. Um, it is from Illinois. We've been around for about three and a half years. Mm -hmm. um, we've done, <clears throat> we've had two double gold at San Francisco World uh, Spirits Championships. Heck yeah, so they're doing it big. We're doing it big. We do it good. We don't do a ton of picks every year, but we do um, maybe six, seven, eight picks, but they're really, really good picks. Mm -hmm. Heck yeah. <clears throat> so, Y'all do the same picks with the same company, or you guys do it with different companies? We do it with different you... companies. We've okay. done Traverse City. Heck yeah. Um, this one's from Jepson's Bourbon. I knew it. Heck idea. yeah. It's MPG. You know it's what? It's just somebody who barely. It don't it. even freaking matter because it says left Twix, and you'll all see it big right here. Dude, so I saw this bottle. Like, let me just say, I saw this bottle. It said left Twix on it, and I'm like... Yeah, <laughs> I have to try that. Will y'all do that with me? Can we do that on a video? Because I feel like that'd be super cool. And he was like, heck yeah, we could do it. Let's do that's it. That's what it is. No, it's all about sharing. Super cool. And that's what bourbon's about. Community. You meet people and you do the thing and you're like, hey, you're real people online, right? right. And we do the thing because we just met today and that's what we do. Yep. So, what do we smell on this? Hmm. Actually, it's like... It's like Cocoa. It smells light. It smells like, like a, a Twix. Cocoa. <laughs> it literally smells like a, a, a caramel. Shortbread kind of caramel. Yeah. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Y'all bring over some like crazy insane stuff or you're like, yo, Matt's gonna love this. Let's do that and do it big. Absolutely. Like, yo, this is really good. I'm glad you enjoy it. I do. Hell yeah. Cheers, Cheers guys. Everybody. Cheers. Oh, dude. So basically, you get your, like, berry light cocoa on the front. You get your, wow, it's like a cookie taste on the back. And then, like, a, a nice warming sensation. If you don't have a warming sensation on the back, you and it's 120 hug. proof, <laughs> like, let me just tell you, you're drinking something wrong. Because this it's gives not, you that. It's but not, it's not hot. No, no, no. You don't get that. You don't get that You get burn. the super easy, warm cake taste, like a... Almost like a graham cracker kick at the back, where it's like absolutely fantastic. This is crazy weird. It's so so y'all got a bottle that has a Twix bar on the side, and it has a taste that I, I just absolutely love. And I love Twix bars, so this is great. I really can't put this down. This is crazy. <laughs> you got to like... I already drank all mine. This is ridiculous. <laughs> all right, so basically, check this out. So you get a, a chocolate taste on the tongue, like on the lips here, and you walk through, and you got a a warming sensation of caramel coming through your mouth, and it kicks you with a graham cracker in the back, and it knocks you back, and it's like warm hug and here and done, and that's where you're at. And you don't get any burn at all. It's no, just, I mean you get that hug, but you do, but it's just. It's and you know so what? Good. And we, I live in Cleveland. I do. And here in Cleveland, let me explain to you. When it's not summertime, it sucks ass in the <laughs> in the winter. All right. So you walk it outside, you're like, oh man, I gotta snow blow my driveway and do the thing. Let me explain to you that this warm hug 
will warm you up to the point yes. to where you could snowball the driveway without a coat on, wearing a Cleveland on the rock shirt, doing In it big. Shorts. Boom, done. And that's it. And that's what it is. I want to go outside and be like, yo, I worked out all winter and I'm good. And I'm getting there and I'm plowing the driveway. This will do it to you. This is quite possibly one of the, this is one of my favorite like drinks right here. I I have only had this today. Literally today, I tried this. Yep. Right? Yep. And we're doing it big, and I'm like, yo, if I was about to go outside and snowball the driveway, and you're like, hey, man, I got to get my car out the driveway, I'd be like, yo, I could do it. <laughs> you know why? Because I'm warm, and I'm doing it, and I'm going outside to do it. And that's killer. They do some super cool picks out here. I just, like... Hopefully I'll get welcome to the group. That'd be great. And we can do it big and I'll be doing a whole bunch of crazy cool picks that y'all do doing a thing. And this is a, absolutely amazing. Because I would plot a driveway and he'd be able to get out and go <laughs> home safe and do the thing. Like, that'd be great. But how much do you guys pay for these barrel picks that you guys do? Are we out that? It all varies. Can, you know, I mean, right. this was like a $65 pick. And ah. So 65 to 80 I mean... I don't know. I don't wait in line. I don't. I'm right. not one of those people. Who they don't have to do that because they do the big thing and they're like, you know what? We do our own barrel picks. We do it, yeah. and they have a group that does the thing and they're like, you know what? We bought a barrel and we did this. Here's how much it's cost. Honestly, I probably shouldn't put the price out there, so that's probably my bad, and that's, that's fine. fine. I'm sorry, but it's between sixty and eighty bucks, and you buy a bottle that tastes like nothing you've ever had. I have three hundred bottles behind me. And all the way over here that you can't see. But this bottle for 60 to 80 bucks would be the most amazing pick. I would buy three or four of these and that'd be great to put them behind me. I would love to have them. But I can't have them because y'all bought them all. Thanks a lot, bro. <laughs> Thanks a lot. No and that's what we do. But honestly, this is fantastic. Don't be afraid to go pick a barrel pick that you know the people that pick the barrel are like, you know what? Y'all will like this, and that's what it is. I think barrel picks are just the way to go. I mean, if you're in a good group and you have a bunch of good guys that are going out and they're picking it and they know what the flavor profiles are that you like mm -hmm. and, and what the, the classic bourbon tastes are, I think that's the way to go. I mean, why wait in line for something that, you know, N.D.H. E. Taylor, single barrel. I mean, <laughs> small batch, whatever. I mean, they're good. Don't get me We've wrong. We've all done that. But don't, Come on. Don't get me wrong. I mean, they're good, but I mean, really, I mean, you get a bottle like this, and it's it's really special. And This would be one that would go on the center that y'all would notice. It says Twix on it, bro. This is I noticed this online, and I'm like, y'all gotta come shoot videos with me. Let's do this. Like, this is crazy. something you want to share with somebody. I mean, this isn't something you just hold to yourself. I mean, it's about... Bourbon's supposed to be about community and sharing and enjoying with people. And, you know, Matt invited me up here, and I'm, I'm really uh, I'm stoked to be here, and I appreciate it. Of course. I'm glad you did. Thank man. you. And I'm glad Thank to you. share. I mean, that's what it's about. I really appreciate it. I appreciate you coming on with us. You're going to see a couple videos with us. Honestly, buy a barrel pick from a, a local group yeah, that likes the local same groups. thing you like. Because there's a lot of people out there that like the same thing you do. Just find them and be like, hey... Can I join your group? And just write them in there and do it big. And, like, people are cool. Like, I'm telling you, there is real people out there. Everybody's not a fake AI person out there online. It's okay. We just met today. I feel like, honestly, super cool. He'll come out here and drink with us in the summer. He might do our Beer Best video with us. It'd be freaking awesome. So, you may see him on a future video or future five videos. It'd be freaking <laughs> awesome. So, I hope you all are doing it big. Buy you a super cool bottle that you've never seen before. And if you have one, put it in the comments. I want to try it. Or let me know your local group. I'd love to join that. That'd be great. And don't just sit there and try to get the Buffalo Trace bottles. That are, <laughs> everybody's after, man, because there are so much better bottles sitting on the shelf, man. I mean, I have nothing against Buffalo Trace. They have some great stuff. But get out there and really try some different bourbons, man, because there, there are stuff sitting on your shelf that's really good stuff that, that you're not going to pay secondary for get out there mm -hmm. and explore it really try for yourself don't just go after what the masses are going for get out there and try for yourself if you find friends like he has you won't have to go to all those expenses to find this and go at seven o'clock in the morning find a line go wait in this do this dude he gets these online with his buddies doing it big 
super cool things. I think that's awesome. I'm gonna join, hopefully I'll be able to be in with his friend. So, I hope y'all let me know about some super cool bottle that we can all try. And if you know anything that we have, or we don't have, put it down here in the comments, that'd be awesome. And make sure you're not drinking and driving if you're out there and you're not at home, because that's the most important thing. Y'all get home safe, be there, people love you, they want to see you tomorrow, bro. So make sure you Uber, Lyft, whatever, don't drink and drive. And while you're doing that, make sure you like, share, and subscribe on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, TikTok. Do all them big things. We'll see you guys next time. Get a shirt, man. Help us support the videos.